Hello, my name is Kim Strauss and today's video will be on the steps necessary to get, to, uh, get credit for bloodborne pathogens and register for that class in Edgeforia. So we're going to begin on the Edgeforia website. So it's brenham.schoolobjects.com and that needs to be typed in at the top of a browser window. Notice there's no www, just brenham.schoolobjects.com. This is a new address for Edgeforia. You may, this may be the first time that you've used it. And so notice that you need your full email address as your username. And this will be your Brenham ISD account. And then you're going to put in the same password as your first class account. So whatever you use for BrenhamISD.net, that'll be the same password that you use to get into Edgeforia. So we're gonna log in. This is the same method that we used when we registered for our summer workshops. Okay, so when the new window opens, we're going to go over here to the left side and click Workshop. And the Workshop panel is going to open. And yours will look like this. To get to the Bloodborne Pathogens course, we're going to go down here to eCourse. That means electronic course, self-paced courses here in Brenham ISD. So we'll click on it. There's lots of courses that we offer to our teachers, but we're going to find the one called Bloodborne Pathogens being offered to everyone in the school district. And we're going to click it. After clicking it, it'll, be, it'll say register right up here. I'm already in the class, and so I'm going to unregister myself and re-register so you can see what it looks like. Okay, so when I go to eCourses, Bloodborne Pathogens, notice it says register up here, so I'm going to click and I'm going to say OK. Yes, I want to register. Okay, once I'm inside the class, um, then I'm going to actually look at the content. So I'm in Bloodborne Pathogens. If I don't get to this um, spot, if you just log into Edgeforia Workshop, click My Portfolio, you'll see all the courses that you signed up for this past year. Um, here's Bloodborne Pathogens, and then I'm back to the workshop right here. Okay, the actual information is right here under the tab called Course Content. So I'm going to click Course Content. There's only one chapter and it says Instructions for Course and View. Okay, so here's the good part. This is what you've been waiting for. Welcome to Bloodborne Pathogens. This is a one-page document that tells you how you're going to take the Bloodborne Pathogens course. We're actually uh, taking the course through Region 6 and there's only three steps. We're going to go to the Region 6 website, TVLC esc6.net we'll click my learning and log in now the username and password was mailed to you this summer from region 6 um, and they're supposed to remail it uh, again this week and so I'm hoping that you have received that email um, it'll be your Brenham ISD username the entire email address like mine is kstrauss at brenhamisd.net there'll also be some type of crazy password if you don't have the email with your login information, you'll go to where it says, I need help with my password, and you'll click and go through a two-step process and they'll re-email you your password. After logging in, you're going to go to step two. You're going to click on eShop, Human Resources, and then click inside of the Bloodborne Pathogens box right here. It'll open. You'll notice that one box asks, asks for $25 and the other one says enter course. Brenham ISD has already paid for the course, so all you have to do is click on enter course. So you enter it. And once you get inside the course, there are four parts to the course. There are the videos on bloodborne pathogens. That's right here. When you finish watching the videos, which are only 14 minutes long, you'll take the quiz, do a short evaluation, and then you'll print a certificate. This certificate will have to be turned in to the nurse on your campus. If your campus does not have a nurse, it'll go to the secretary. Okay, so that's what Edgeforia telling you how to get to ESC6. So let's actually go to ESC6. So this is my address, and if I can highlight across it and copy it, or I can just write it down because I can type it in. I'm going to minimize this window because I've got to get back to a window with an address bar at the top. And I will paste in the address or you can just retype it. tvlcesc6.net and I'm going to click enter. My learning. I'm going to log in. kstrauss at brenhamisd.net is my username and then I'm going to put in my password. and log in. 
Now I'm going to go to the eShop, Human Resources, Bloodborne Pathogens, enter the course. From here I'll watch the videos, take the quiz, take the evaluation, and get my certificate. When you click the enter course, if you do not get a pop-up window with the video inside of it, it means that your pop-up blockers are on. So make sure that you turn off your pop-up blockers and that you can actually, and that can be done through, depending on what browser you're using, through the options tab. But turn off your pop-up blockers so that the video actually opens. I hope this assisted you in finding the Bloodborne Pathogens course within Edgephoria and the TVLC website.